Today's lunch for my eleven-month baby girl: pork finger ribs, some boiled triple-color baby carrots, home plant soft persimmon, and some boiled baby Chinese cabbage. For the pork finger ribs, remove all the cartilages at the end of all the ribs. First, blanch the pork ribs. Place the pork ribs in a skillet and make sure the amount of water can cover the entire rib. Bring the water to a boil. Wait for five minutes and then remove the ribs and drain. The reason of doing this is I do not want to cook pork ribs straight away with blood on it. Then start with getting some fresh water in the skillet. Put all the ribs in the water. Then put some sliced gingers and green onion in the water to get rid of the unpleasant smell. If you don't have green onion at home, you can also use cooking wine. You can also add some vegetables of your choice to cook along with the pork ribs, like corn, radish, carrots. Just make sure the water you add to the skillet can cover the entire ingredients. I cooked for an hour. The meat is very loose and soft. It's very easy for my baby to get some of the meat off the bone. For the vegetable, I offer to my baby. It's very simple. Just add the vegetable in boiled water and add some olive oil. Wait until it's tender. I did the cabbage and the carrots separately because it takes longer for the carrots to cook. My baby is eleven months, so at this time I didn't add salt to her meal. Our home plant persimmon is very soft. It's like melting ice cream. It's not the regular ones you get from the market that are as hard as stone. I used to looking for the soft persimmon at the grocery store, but I never find them. Zoe loves tearing the vegetable with her teeth. I thought that is so cute. I don't know how your baby is doing with vegetables, but Zoe is very picky on vegetables. She'll never eat the carrots. I'll never give up trying.